Hey everyone, Jacob here, and today I want to share with you another tutorial. This time it's going to be personalized print on demand. So if you've ever wanted to sell Etsy personalized products like these that I'm going to put on the screen here, then you probably, you know, have ran into the issue of how do I actually ensure that this is going to be exactly what the customer wants? You're also probably wondering how to automate that process. Well, anywhere POD you'll see today in this tutorial, you can actually automate the personalized upload process and allow your customer to do the cropping, the image uploads, the placement of everything, and then submit their order for personalization and actually send it through. So we're going to walk through step by step how you can actually do that today. And I am honored to bring back Chris Meets the owner of Anywhere POD. So this goes beyond just personalization. We're actually doing a series where we actually show you how to use AI filters. So for example, if you wanted to have a product where a customer is allowed to upload a photo and then an AI filter is used to turn them into a Simpsons character, turn them into a, you know, a chibi style, a lot of different new features that I want to share with you. And I brought on Chris so that he could best explain these new features to you, but we're going to be going step-by-step step through building out actual products. And this time in this video, we built out a personalized ornament for moms. So I hope you guys enjoy this specific video is going to be about the live Etsy personalized feature. So having your customer actually be able to see the live preview. This entire playlist is dedicated to just sharing tips and tricks and strategies on how to actually succeed in personalized print on demand. And if you would do me a quick favor, and if you get value from this video, please subscribe. Uh, it's 100% free to do so, but it really helps me out. So if you could hit the subscribe button, if you haven't done so already, I would really, really appreciate that. Otherwise, if you have any questions about anything that we're doing in this video, please drop it in the comments below and we'll get back to you as quickly as we can. So I hope you enjoy. Without further ado, here is Chris Meets showing us the Etsy live preview option for personalized products. Yeah, absolutely. So we got uh, quite a few new features. So excited to uh, kind of walk you through a few examples and, and a few demos here on uh, some of the exciting new stuff that we have that really hasn't been accomplished with Etsy before and really kind of opens up the door to the possibilities of the types of products and how easily you can uh, create listings and get back to doing the things that are going to drive sales on your store and having to spend less time on dealing with orders and dealing with mock-ups and all the, the fun uh, soul-sucking tasks that you normally in the past had to do with every listing that um, now you can completely automate. Nice. So definitely some like AI features and automations, it seems like. Yeah. Yeah. So we're, uh, we're fully integrated with some really cool AI tools now that are going to help with um, some designs that you can do, especially on the personalization side um, and also making it a lot easier um, to come up with uh, correct SEO for your list listings um, in really kind of a unique way that, that other people aren't doing that um, I'm ex excited to show to everybody today. Awesome. Sounds good. Cool. So let's uh, let's jump into it. I'll uh, share my screen here. Okay. So this is uh, Anywhere POD. If you haven't used Anywhere POD before, um, we've actually done some other videos with uh, Jacob in the past that kind of goes through the nuts and bolts of, of how to set everything up. Um, but you can see here, I'm already connected to uh, my Etsy and Shopify and then all of my print providers. Um, so we are a tool that kind of sits on top of your print providers to add in some of this additional functionality that usually is not available from the uh, print providers directly. This first one that I want to talk about here is going to be about our new live preview feature on Etsy. Um, this really is kind of a game changer when it comes to personalization on Etsy, um, because now you can actually show your customers a live preview of their personalization options before they purchase on Etsy. So they're able to actually upload photos to you, do all of the per personalization, be a proof without having to mess with. In the past, you had to send Etsy messages back and forth and hope the customer sent it to you and deal with Etsy messages, compressing images, like all of that is out the window now and you can now automate that entire process. So I'm gonna walk through the setup of that for you guys real quick and kind of show you what that feature looks like. Super easy to set up, especially with our Canva integration. 
Um, so we're going to walk through an ornament covering a, uh, a file upload. So the customers will be able to upload their own photos. Um, so it can be, uh, like I said, a great, great tool to be able to automate the entire process of the whole photo upload process. So we're going to create a, uh, a Christmas ornament here. So I'm going to come into our product catalog here. The product creation process here is very similar to how you build products on Printify. But instead of building the product on Printify, we're going to create that product in Anywhere POD so we can add in this additional functionality. So we're going to go with our ceramic ornament here. So I'm going to go to Start Designing. Uh, now, one of the reasons I wanted to show you guys the product building process is we're also fully integrated with Canva. So a lot of times when you're doing photo uploads, you're going to want the image that the customer uploads to not just be a square or a rectangle, but for it to display in a particular shape, like a heart or an M or, or what have you. So if you're using Canva, you can actually import your design as layers directly from Canva. It is going to automatically pull in the frames that you have set up in Canva and have that set up in our cropper tool all automatic for you. So when I come here, I can go to add from Canva. This is going to show me all of my most recent designs. So you can see here we have our kind of mom themed design here where they can upload uh, uh, image into each letter of the word mom. If I go to import layers. This is going to import that entire design like as though I originally designed it in Anywhere POD. So not only is it going to import with my text and the correct font and size already set up, so I just have to mark that text field as personalized, but it's also going to import those images already in the correct shapes to be automatically personalized. So here is my text that's kind of as a signature down at the bottom. So I just need to mark that as personalized. And then if I take a look at any of these images, you'll see they're already set up and good to go. I don't need to do anything with these images. They're already marked as personalized and they're already set up to be cropped to a custom shape. So the setup process on this is super, super simple. So we're just gonna do a circle ornament here and we're gonna come down here and go to create product. And now this is gonna generate uh, our placeholder artwork for us with everything set up in our designer exactly how I had it. And then it's also going to generate any mock-ups that are available for us. So you can see we still have access to all of the Printify mock-ups. We also have a custom, a couple of custom mock-ups in here that we already created. You can see those automatically generate. We set those up uh, earlier in our account as a mock-up template. So those just automatically generate for us. So we don't even have to manually create mock-ups anymore when we use Anywhere POD. So another huge time-saving task there. So of course here we can set up our title, description, and tags. Um, you can set those here, you can update them in Etsy still. We do have a really cool tool here to help generate um, your title tags and descriptions with AI that we'll be covering in, in, in uh, more detail in another video here with Jacob. Um, but for now, we wanna kind of focus on the live previews. So you can see here under my personalization instructions, I have the option here to enable live preview. So to do that, I just need to click on Enable Life Preview here at the top. And if I click here, this will turn on that Life Preview uh, for this product. Now using Life Previews are completely optional. So you can still, and actually we still recommend if all you're doing is text, like if you're just needing a name and a date, we still recommend just using Etsy's kind of text field for that um, because you don't need a separate Life Preview. The, the purchase process is a little bit simpler um, when you don't have that. So where this really shines is any time that you want to offer a photo upload or something that's a little more ultra personalized where you're offering, you know, like image collections or clip art for the customer to choose from. That sort of thing is really where this comes in powerful. So we can see here we have our uh, live preview turned on. So we just need to update our personalization instructions to include the uh, live preview information. We have a nice little button here that will uh, add some basic instructions here for you. Of course, you can change those however you want, um, but this will add the instructions so the customer knows to go to the URL and be able to upload any of their images and, and that sort of thing. So let me, uh, we'll save this and then let me jump over to a live listing for us over on Etsy. At this point, this is ready to publish over. So let me go to one on Etsy here that I've already published and uh, I can show you what it looks like and kind of what the, the user experience and customer flow looks like to be able to offer these live previews. 
we're going to get into some really cool stuff we have with AI filters in a future video. So make sure to come back and check that out. But they can even apply, uh, a, you can apply uh, those AI filters to the customer's image automatically. They can see what it looks like and improve it. Like it really is a complete game changer when it comes to personalization because this has not been offered on Etsy before where you can actually like automate the process of photo uploads in the yeah. past, you had to have the customer send you an Etsy message or send you an email, and then you got to get that from them, hope they send it to you. Um, it really was a bit of a headache um, to do photo personalization on Etsy. This completely automates that process, lets the customer upload the image before they even purchase. And then on the back end, when the order comes in, everything's completely automated. Nice. Yeah, this is the first time that I've seen a solution like this. Uh, yeah, it, this is way, way better than trying to chase down customers yeah. and get photos from them. So awesome. I'm excited, yeah. excited to see what it looks like. Yeah, this really is one of those things that like in the past, like we made it before this feature, we made it as easy as possible to do photos. But we would still if you were, you know, kind of new to print on demand or new to Etsy, we actually would say don't mess with trying to figure out photos yet like focus on the text personalization that's a lot simpler to do on etsy with this new feature this really opens it up um you like you don't have to be experienced and know the ends of out and outs of what do i do if the customer doesn't send a photo like this takes care of all that and really opens it up that even if you're a new seller it makes it really easy to do this type of photo personalization especially with our canva integration like you set it up once in canva you don't have to like reset up a whole bunch of stuff and it really kind of just smooths out the whole process, makes it super easy. Even if you're kind of new to print on demand, it really opens up the possibilities of what you can do without such a huge learning curve. All right, so here is our live listing on Etsy. So you can see down here uh, in the personalization instructions, um, we have the link listed here where we tell them, you know, go to this link, upload your photos, and then you can come back here for the purchase. We take care of kind of closing that loop so you don't have to worry about them, you know, missing a tab or, or losing your listing. It's going to redirect them back here to the listing automatically to complete their purchase. So if I go to this link, you'll see here they get a live preview page. They're able to enter in um, any, in this case, the text that they want. So we can say uh, Mike and John, for example. And then here, when they upload any of their photos, they will get the uh, actual image cropper. So they can see in this case, we've got the M. They can see what portion is actually going to go into each one of the images that they upload here. Nice. That's awesome. And this works for pretty much any shape that you want to do. You can do your own custom shapes. It'll automatically, like I said, with the uh, frames in Canva, it's automatically going to set those up to use this image cropper. Um, but if you have a different shape you want to do or you're doing some sort of custom shape, we have that full flexibility in Anywhere POD to be able to automatically handle any of that. All right, so we have our last one cropped here. As a customer, I'm happy with what I see. I'm ready to continue with the order. So I just need to click on Next here. That's going to give them this personalization ID here. And when they click on Continue on Etsy, it's going to copy that information for them. There's also a copy button there that they can click. It's going to take them right back to your Etsy listing. And all they have to do is paste that into the personalization field. And when they complete the order and it comes in, Anywhere POD is going to be able to read that special personalization ID. And we're going to be able to automatically take all of the files that they uploaded, all of the text they entered, correctly apply it to your artwork, and submit this to your print provider uh, for production. You can set it up to review it so you can uh, you know, take a look before it goes over to production if you want to, but it literally completely automates that entire process and makes it super, super simple for you to be able to offer these types of designs. And it's so easy and so great for the customer. We're really excited about it. The, yeah, this is a huge update for both the customer and for the seller for sure. Yeah, I love this. All right, guys, you saw everything that you can do here with Anywhere POD and these personalized images, letting your customer actually choose where to crop the image and everything. This makes it a lot easier, even if you've never you know, offered personalization before to get into personalization. To make that even easier of a decision for you, you are going to get a free month of Anywhere POD if you do want to try it out. Um, so you can test it out, see if it might be right for you, something you'd want to implement into your print on demand business. And that code is going to be Jacob30, and I'll have a link for that in the description below.
Chris, do you have anything else before we wrap up? Yeah, just uh, thanks for having me on again. Make sure to check out some of our other videos that are coming. Like this feature is super awesome, but the other ones that we have are right up there with it, especially with what you can do with some of the, the AI filters. Like Jacob said, you can check it out for free for the first month in the description. Um, our customer support really is kind of top notch. So we kind of pride ourselves in the level of customer support that we that we give. So if you get into it and you have any questions at all, please don't hesitate to reach out to our team. We're always more than happy to help. And uh, we hope you guys get in and take advantage of that free month. This is the perfect time to start listing some of these products right before Q4. Um, and you can really, really uh, be able to automatically scale going into Q4 without, uh, you know, worry about getting bogged down with dealing with customer photos. This really is going to be a game changer for you and your store uh, this Q4 season, I think. So uh, we're excited to see everybody on the inside. Yeah, definitely, guys. Check that out in the video description. Comment below if you have any questions about anything we covered today. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't yet. Create something awesome. Take action from what you've learned. And uh, again, that link is going to be in the video description below. Thanks, Chris. Thank you. Thanks, everybody.